Boatland Cement. Cement is manufactured by two methods. They are 1. Wet process 2. Dry process Now, let us discuss wet process and dry process in detail. Wet process In the wet process, first, the clay is purified by washing in a wash mill. The limestone is crushed into small particles and mixed with purified clay in proportions to get raw slurry. Dry process In the dry process, the raw materials are mixed in proper proportions. The mixture is dried, pulverized, crushed into fine particles and made uniform. The resulting powder is called raw material. The raw slurry or raw meal obtained by one of wet or dry process called charge. Charge is introduced into a rotary kiln. A rotary kiln consists of a steel cylinder about 150 meters long and 4 meter diameter and rotates 30 to 60 turns per hour. At one end of the cylinder, a screw conveyor is arranged which slowly allows the charge into the cylinder. The other end of the cylinder, a burner is arranged. Coal or burning oil is burnt at this end. The charge entering the cylinder slowly moves towards the hot end. At the burning end of the kiln, the temperature is around 1700 to 1900 degrees centigrade. At this end, some chemical reaction takes place between calcium oxide and aluminum silicates. Mixture of calcium silicates and calcium aluminates is formed. The resultant product consists of grey hard balls called clinker cement. Clinker cement is cooled, ground to fine powder and mixed with 2 to 3% of gypsum.